What's up guys, we're out here in Felsmere again today and it's pretty windy. Uh, it's probably about 12 mile an hour or so and it's supposed to get up to 20 mile an hour winds today. It's supposed to have a lot of rain come this afternoon. So we're only out here for a short period of time. Uh, we're gonna try to get to our normal spots, see what's over there. And then once the weather starts getting real bad, then we'll just let the wind push us back to the ramp and try to avoid this rain. I'm just going straight to my spots. So I'm not going to fish on the way. So we got a south wind, water temp 69. So that's pretty good. South winds are usually pretty good too. All right, we're down to one camera right now. We're letting the other one charge. So while that charges, I'm just going to use this one. Come on, come on with it. Woo, that's a good one. No, no don't do that. Oh, yeah. Whew. It barely hooked. Oh, a hook fell out. Look at that. That was a decent one for the first one of the day. Probably a good two and a half, almost three. Oh, 18 and a half. All right. 3.2. Goodbye. <laughs> that was a weird release. All right. So. I don't have any more June bug speedworms. I might have some more at the house, but I don't have any here. So what I'm gonna try is Old Monster in the plum color. I'm gonna try that and see uh, if that works here. I have this same thing, the same worm in a June bug color. So if this color doesn't work, we'll just go to June bug and hopefully that will work. There's already someone at my next canal. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a decent one. Eh, a little smaller than the last one, but I'll take it. I'm a smaller guy, but 14, uh-uh, stop it. 14 and three quarter. Goodbye. I'm gonna try the tire bait real quick. Tire bait. Oh, it's a mud. What fish? Little guy. I got him. Oh. Oh. Oh my God. No, no, no. Oh my God. <laughs> Not as big as I thought it was going to be, but it's still a big one. On the spitter bait, the 19 and a quarter. All right, 3.48. Goodbye. Well, it's nice to meet you. Are you, you look familiar, you have a YouTube channel or something? Yes, I do. Yeah, yeah my name's Chris. Yeah, I've seen some of your videos. What's your name? Eric. Eric? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Right. See ya. Got this all. Oh, that's another good one. Okay. Another like another like three, I think. Eighteen and a quarter. Almost touch eighteen and a half. Alright. I'm not gonna bother measure or weighing them. I know it's not bigger than the other one, but it's a nice, another nice one. <sighs> Goodbye. Oh. More for that grass point. Oh, he's digging. Skinny guy. Goodbye. Fella I met today, name's Eric, told me that they were biting on the spinner bait, so I switched to the spinner bait, and so far it's doing pretty well. Oh my god! 
What was that? Oh my god. Dude, that swirl. Whatever came, whatever fish that was, that swirl off that thing. Wow. I was not ready for that. All right, I'm gonna hit there. Pretty good day today. I caught some decent ones. Um, they're all in like the 18, uh, 16 inch range. I'm happy with it. It. I thought it was supposed to rain a little sooner, but I ain't complaining. Uh, it is still coming, so I'm gonna start heading on in. And by the time I get to the truck and onto the road, I think it's gonna start raining. So everything was basically off that spinner bait ever since. Uh, Eric told me that he was catching his fish off that spinnerbait. I switched over from that chatterbait to the spinnerbait and I was catching them. So thanks to him for uh, cluing me in on that little detail there. Ran out of speed worms, so I didn't really have a choice but to fish other stuff. I tried like the ribbon tail worms and stuff and that kind of worked, but it seemed like the spinnerbait was the, the bait for today. And I was just throwing it against the grass edge and reeling it back. I didn't really let it sink too much. As soon as it hit the water, I just basically reeled it in. Not too fast, not too slow, just a, like a moderate speed. And that's what I was getting my bites on. But tomorrow, I think I'm going to Toho because I, I know uh, one of you guys asked me if I could go over there and check it out, see what it's all about. So, well, I'll be in Toho tomorrow. That'll be in the next video on Friday. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for that. If you enjoyed, leave a like on the bottom. Subscribe if you have not subscribed yet. Catch you in the next one.